so 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 click welcome back to my youtube channel if you're a newbie a warm 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 welcome to you and if you're a regular what's up you know the vibes you know the vibes um welcome back to my youtube channel thank you so much for taking your time to tune in you know tune into the loudest girl that you'll ever meet in your life anyways guys i'm back and i'm better well i think i'm trying to be you know i'm trying to be better i'm trying to be innovative i'm trying to be fresh i'm trying to be you know, keep... anyway so um today i'm back with a video of myself um doing my own makeup disclaimer right i am not a professional makeup artist one two i don't know how to do makeup like dead ass i like i'm not a pro I just do it in G, just in G. You understand what I'm saying? So today we're going to be doing my makeup thing. And also just touching base on, if you didn't know, um, Amu is currently 11 months. And I'm just going to be touching base on my, ex like, not experience as such, but a reflection basically on, on him, you know, and yeah basically how it's been for me and i'm also going to just touch base on my surgery as i posted on my instagram stories that i i had a surgery and yeah how i've been dealing with it and yeah just to touch base and yeah so let's get let's get let's get let's get, let's get. so first and foremost now this is my makeup Lady Roll, Lady Roll, Lady Roll. This is my makeup bag, and then here's my palette. It's a palette, now guys. It's a palette. Like I'm not trying to like this is not a makeup tutorial, do no. Oh, also I I apply um sunscreen like every sun sunscreen first before I. <sighs> I'm looking for my lip filler. Because my lips are dry. They drew it. They drew it. Okay, anyways. Okay, let's start. Let's start. So, where should I start? Yo, guys, now I can't multitask, honestly. Hey, So, if I ramble the whole video, you are... See, I am really... But where will I start? Um, I actually wrote this down. Like, actually, because I knew what I was going to. Just, you know... So, I'll just start off by saying it's been a bittersweet. Like I always say, everything is bittersweet in my life. Ebo bi, oh, ebo bi, oh. How do you say in my life, Mkosa? Ebo, ebo, yo, yo, ebo mi, yo. Let's leave it. Go and look. Like the way I haven't even been like applying makeup, guys. I'd like just like look at this. But anyways, I have my mirror here that will help me just do the teams, you know? Let's sharpen it. But yeah, uh, it's been bittersweet, honestly. It's been bittersweet in the sense that, like, honestly, honestly, like, I don't know if, 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 if it weren't for Amu, like, Dead ass, I don't know if I'd still be here. Like, you know, like I am I even doing this right? Okay. I don't know if I'd still be here. You know, because of a lot of reasons, like hey guys, yeah, go and shabby and yeah, like yo, it's tough. And like I look at him and I'm like, my nigga, if you run for you someone would be crying today like thinking of if Celine was here dead ass you know but it's been bittersweet you know there's good there's the ups there's the downs ah, ah, ah. oh ah, this is the gloss <gasps> no 
I'll be back. Yeah, sorry about that. I just, I had to fetch the, my eyebrow gel. So it's been that and yeah. So I'm grateful for him, like super, 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 super grateful for him because like only got news, eh? But um, yeah, it's that and like i wish like there's so many things that you guys don't know that as a mom you go through and like you're forced to kind of like be like being a mom is not like it's not according to age like you don't it's not like growing up you know like you grow up in these like stages like obviously as a child you can't be like worrying about rent or what the kids are gonna eat whatever whatever because it's not your time yet like honestly it's not yet your time to be worrying about that you should be focusing on school and getting those distinctions and securing bags and i mean securing education man so that you can secure your bags you know so being a mom forces you to kind of uh please don't judge the way i do my makeup i beg so being a mom like kind of like just it forces you to what you might call this Shh, guys iphones iphones are tricky also you know they can be tricky these days it forces you to like grow up legit like legit like it just it forces you to just mature like there's no break to say ah this is not time for me to do this or whatever like literally you're forced to mature literally speaking like you are just forced to mature and that's been the hardest thing because you have to think like a mom you have to you don't think according to your age you think according to being a mom you understand what i'm saying so it's that and oh guys it's it's been challenging honestly to say the least hey like it's really been challenging like it's hard to like i i i i, I live on takeaways literally because I how am I gonna do this now because now I can't even I hope you guys can see me. But yeah, I live on takeaways. Like literally I live on takeaways because there's no time to be making food. Like sneaming the baby's hungry now the baby must also eat. It's a lot, yeah, it's a lot. So now imagine you haven't slept at night, you're busy nursing the child because you want smoke. And then also, you must now prepare food for him. You must wake up because Amu, you know, Amu wakes up at half past seven. With me, he wakes up at half past seven. But with my mom, he decides to wake up at eight. Your guys is faith, child. So he he wakes up at that time, and it, yo guys, me yo I love my sleep. Hey, your Lord knows, Shem. Cause like I really, 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 really love my sleep. So, you don't even get time to, like, make food. Because you, you, like, you just focus on the baby and the baby eating. Literally. The one and only. Can only be my baby sending me a message. Literally. So... yeah it's that like you live on takeaways and i thought i was the only one until like someone also said it that because it's easier it's quicker like you just uber eats and you pay lilinda but like there's your food you know and like having to make food for the baby and i'm so bad at meal prep because i feel like i don't like i'm eating like the same things like uh -uh, i don't like it like you must eat peanut butter. Yo, what peanut butternut? If he's eating a butternut today, tomorrow he must eat um a jam squash or sweet potato. You know, so I don't I, I don't know about meal prep. Like I feel like ugh, even me as a person, I don't want to eat the same food. So I I don't honestly I don't want to lie to you guys. Like I don't do meal prep. Did I? I don't do meal prep. 
um so that's that the fact that like it's easier to just uber eat and now imagine you're trying to go on a diet because obviously there's either um weight gain weight or gain You either gain weight or you lose weight. <laughs> weight loss or weight gain. Yes, that one. Which one is that one? So with me it was a loss. It was a you know, it was a weight loss. Yeah. It was a weight loss. You understand? So I'm going to do mark I hear because I am not focused. So it was that and I've been trying to gain weight. I tried joining the gym. I must like go back and fix my papers because, hey, yeah, whatever. So, how long is this video? Five minutes, okay. So, that's that. And oh, just the pressures of um being the best mom we can ever be. You know, like ever so often, we like, we don't want to make the same mistakes our parents made. You know, but even in that, you don't realize that your fear just overcomes everything. And you actually start, what's this, making those very same mistakes. You understand what I mean? Like, you start making those very same mistakes that you, you, you yourself, you didn't want to make. But you find yourself making those same mistakes, you know, because you're so worried about being a better parent. You're so worried about being a better parent that you just end up not being a better parent and you're pushing your child away so you're constantly trying to be better you're constantly trying to do better you know also just the pressures of um making money like making money for your child you get what i mean like yo guys even this video even though i haven't healed i was like ah sis you can't be down and under like you can't come and die you know you can't come and also want to die you must pick one you get what i mean so that's that like i said yeah i don't know how to do makeup yeah so please don't even judge me guys so yeah that's that and oh but it's actually coming out nice i think i think i hope so but yeah um that's that and it can really get like super overwhelming like oh it gets too much like you just miss being like now Amu's nanny is gone you know she left me like she not that she left me I'm making it sound like I'm in dire need no but she's gone but luckily Amu's asleep and I'm just like alone with him and here I am trying to like shoot content and it gets overwhelming man you miss your space you you miss a lot of things that you used to do before there was there was this peso you know what i mean so am i doing it the right uh, uh, oopsie which hand do i usually do it with maybe because i'm holding the mirror i don't even guys why is makeup detailing how can i do it so yeah guys um you miss your own space you know you miss your own space you like even when i was sick i was just not was because i still am but you just miss not having to worry about him you know like i was so worried about him like i remember like when we got back from my surgery the first thing i wanted to see was him i'm like even though i was crying and screaming the whole way because i even got stitched up you know so even when i was like crying i was like can i just see um like i just asked my mom please bring um can i see him you know like also just the fear that what if he forgets me you know what i mean because like he's spending a lot of time with his granny my mom so it gets worrying like i get super super worried and jealous sometimes i won't even lie about that no cap no cap so it gets super worrying for me i'm like oh, oh you know so yeah what else but overall man it's it's been quite a journey like 
he really really motivates me like genuinely like that's why i'm even doing this video because i'm like sis you can't be sleeping on the bag yeah you're not okay but like do something you're literally sitting down like come on now come on weedy three shoes come on weedy you know I go, oh, okay i found it so i was like ah sis you can't come and die yeah? well, i've been repeating it so ah uh, guys it's been that really and i just i'm grateful you know i'm grateful i'm with such a blessing like and i don't even know honestly like what i'm gonna do for his first because i honestly just wanted like intimate vibes like straight up like i wanted intimate vibes like with his family and you know just family vibes like nothing hectic honestly but i don't know we shall see really we shall see what we do but yeah um i do man i miss i miss having to go out because me i'm a rock star i'm a rockist i rock but when i run a rock i can rock okay this part guys i really have to concentrate like so um, let me just do it so yeah I, I managed to do that so as i was saying like i do miss my freedom i miss uh, i miss a lot guys i really miss a lot but at the same time i'm like i think i needed that to be focused you know um i needed him i really did i needed that boy like if i could i just call him needed if i could <laughs> literally <laughs> literally if i could i just call him needed because wow wow not a me if i could really guys me i'd call my son needed hey i'm one day gonna watch this and be like mommy what is here but like yes yeah, son did as did as did as i'm calling that okay and then should i touch base on how are these eyebrows looking? Ah, uh, guys. Me, I don't know how to do makeup properly. Eh? I just do it for the vibes, for the vibes. Yeah, I got it too close. Okay, yeah, better. It's fine. So, should I dive into my surgery or whatever? Um, that was like a very. I don't know if I can call it dark time, but um, it was a very dark time. But it was dark not for long, you know, because God got me. And there's some period, God, 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 ha, oh, bam, what? Because God got me, you know what I mean? So, um, I don't want to talk about it too much because I'm still in the healing process and it's quite a sensitive topic to me where certain people feel like it's it's a joke and it's it's fun times because and i know those very same people are the ones who are busy viewing my stuff yeah but anyways i don't wanna be peso and put you know yourself you know yourself and you will laugh because you know that I'm talking to you. What am I even doing now? So, ah, guys, I didn't even prime my face. Like, what are you? What are you? Uh, um, yeah. There was the thing of the surgery. And I never ever saw myself recovering. Literally, like, I never even saw myself recovering. I had dark thoughts. I was like, what's the point of me living anymore? Like, I couldn't even eat, bruv. Like, I couldn't even eat, my nigga. Mm -hmm. And when I had to, like, take tablets. You don't ask me what I'm doing now because this is how I do my makeup. <laughs> so, yeah, I had to, like, take tablets. Literally, I had to take tablets and there was a time where 
I, I was taking like um, 30 tablets a day literally I was taking like 30 tablets a day because I had to take for pains like the stitches and I also had to just take for um, yeah what what I had to do the surgery for I had to take uh, painkillers for what the surgery was for and also for the stitches they were making some sense right so that was that and guys this is hard eh? it's hard it's really hard especially because like i'm even sitting on the floor for you guys so am i even doing the right yeah what am i doing then so vela vela i'm not going to control what's happening i guess i need to control i'm not going to yeah control your eyebrows 